We saw Gabo's work. Teamer Joel Rail. This deck With does this stuff. Card. Whenever you draw your second card, create a 2 2 cat. Yeah, and sure. It's all, let's about, try this. it's all about doing stuff. So we got Opt, we got Crash Through, which is just a cantrip. We want to play a goal rail, Joel Rail and start playing Cats. Whenever you cast a spell that's white, blue, black, or red, we put a plus one, plus one counter of Quirion. This is Scry 3, draw a card. This is Gross Spiral for draw, Return for tempo, Dasher for draw, and Bone Crusher because Bone Crusher is good. Oh! Look at that art stretch. All right, this is Teamer Joel Rail from Yo Man 5. Make sure to check him out on Twitter, Yo Man underscore 5. Baby. Thanks to everybody for hanging out today. Oh, dude, it was. That deck was a blast. That deck was really fun. So I guess you could just, yeah, I mean, I don't hate this. Yep, this is a turn two growth spiral. Oh, it's a turn two well, Joel Rail is what it is. You wanted to opt on turn one there? Or I thought about it, but I'm I'm just watching your line to see what I think about what you would have, what you're doing. Basically, I want to guarantee myself green mana on turn two. So we're gonna go get my Ikoria Basic Forest, mm -hmm. and we're going to attempt to get our Joel Rail going. Counterspell. Nope. Omen of the Sea. Moment of the sea is fine to see. It is Joel Rail. So this is once a turn, whenever you draw your second card each turn. Yep, so we don't want to go all in. We just want to kind of save them. It's another Sanctum deck. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense to have stuff like Opt in hand and Growth Spiral in hand. So, um, yeah, I guess Growth Spiral and Hope for Green, right? Well, I we can also, don't... yeah, we can just crash through right now. It's a nice little cantrip, and we'll be open to growth spiral. Wait, give me, give me just a second. Does she say each turn? Yeah, when you draw your second card each turn. Oh, so e EOT, you're growth spiraling on their turn. Oh my god, that's so sick. Well, it's second card, so we will have not drawn a first card on their turn. We would need to figure out a way to draw two cards on their turn, if that's what we were going to do. Oh, I see. Yeah, I see. Never mind. No, it's well, all good. I think you could. I think you could steam vents because then you could double growth spiral EOT. If you steam vents and stay up, you can hit whatever they play with Bone Crusher. I can't growth spiral times two, but I do like staying open for Bone Crusher. That's a fine line. That's a fine line for me. Yeah, but then next turn you could stay open for growth spiral times two, and then you're gonna create you. cats. <laughs> Oh, it's shrines. Okay. So right now we're just trying to ramp. We're not going to use this to draw a card because we want to get to her other ability. Oh, yeah, baby. Now this one, you could grow spiral and opt on their EOT and then make another cat. That is true. So definitely hold those back. That's nice. That's good. Yeah, I like that C dash or octopus in this deck. Yeah, it's nice to see an octopus getting played. 
Thoughts on using Obnixilis as opposed to Underworld Dreams? I figure he's easier to get rid of than Dreams. Yes. Yes. I mean, there's multiple... Oh, look at this. We got a shot of the sky. There it goes. Well, then what I would do, if they're going to do Shatter the Sky, are they playing it right now? Yeah, oh yeah. Where was the mana for it? Um, they added mana with this. At the beginning of your pre-combat main phase, add X mana of any one color where X is the number oh. of shrines you control. Well, then I guess just EOT shoot face with Bone Crusher and an Opt. I think I want a Growth Spiral and Opt. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was just thinking because, you know, if you want to get the two damage to the face and then play the Bone Crusher just to present a 4-3 threat, that's one way to go. Because I don't think they're going to play creatures. So it yeah, just seems... I could like... still I can still do all that on my turn, too. I want to try and get back to another Joel Rail. Because we do run four in this deck. Yeah. Good Growth Spiral again. Save the opt. Go grab a green. Yeah. Oh, is there another green in this deck? Nope, there is not. No, there is not. Well, here you go. Well, then. Now I'll shoot yeah. him. We've got this track down card. Scry 3, reveal the top card of your library if it's a land. If it's a creature or a land, draw a card. Yeah, that seems good. And then, worst case scenario, you could just play your Bone Crusher. I just want to get back to Joel Rail. I guess I could... No, because I want to try and draw a card. It's an opt. Yeah. All right, well... It's 4-3. I mean, it's something that they have to d deal with. Definitely. So. Tap target creature for 6 minus 1 for each shrine. We're cultivating. We just don't want to see multiple Shatter of the Sky. I don't want to see another Shatter of the Sky. Ooh, yeah, Joel. in response. I could see it as... um. Yeah, absolutely. Sorry, I'm fixing this. I could see it as redundancy if you wanted to go full into mono black on that deck. All right, so he bounces that, but then um, you're going to just be able to shoot it. Yeah. That's value. Um, I would bounce the the green shrine to prevent that bullshit. Instead of but getting the threat out there? Not. I mean, I I see the value in both, but I do Regardless, we gotta get through yeah. we gotta get through their um removal. So if they have mana to cast it fine, if they don't, fine. Yeah, that's true. And I could stay up. Growth Spiral. Bounce at EOT just to really throw off their tempo. Or even flash in the brazen so that we could get a Dasher Octopus on it and start doing some damage. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think I like the Bone Crusher. Sure. Yeah, we're just going to present threats. They know we have it. If they're focusing their attention on that, that's fine. <laughs> These, the thing is, is these shrines don't really... It's adding two mana. See, they're yeah. cycling. They're trying to find answers right now. They're cycling main phase. Right? Okay. Play that second main. Yeah, swing low, sweet chariots. 
Yeah, I think we're just going to swing here and see if they've got anything. They definitely have some instant speed. No, they can tap it down. Nope, they're letting it attack. We're going to try and flash this on. Whoops. He sneaks under the giant. Nice, that's four damage on a card. I would just play it untapped just in case. Yep. Right? Yep. Because we want the borrower on the field as an attacker if nothing else happens on our side. Yeah. And we yeah, could flash it digging, in after man. like a uh, digging like crazy. shatter this guy. It's a fun little teamer deck. God, yeah, it actually is fun. Triomes have just added so much heat. To just mana bases. Yeah, and it's funny, mana bases are still pretty clunky. Especially once shock lands rotate. Oy, oy, oy. They're going to have to put something, but they're going to put some interesting land into Zendikar. They would have to, right? For sure. Thematically. For sure, they will. <laughs> Another shatter. Okay, so that happens. So you could grow spiral in response. Or no, you want a brazen EOT, that's right. Yeah, I think I want to keep an attacker on the field. Yeah, I like that idea. <laughs> Actually, we're going to return that to their hand. Yeah, really set off their tempo. I like that. Um, just a second. I can growth and do that. I've got the stomping. Oh, yeah. Good moves. Good moves are good. <laughs> Query and stomp. It's just like, all right, I'm not playing around the third shatter of the sky. <laughs> if you got it, you got it. Bring it. Let's go. I tempo but still, you. in a way, you are because you do have the brazen in the back pocket just in case. Right, right. Yeah, exactly. But yeah, if they have... Oh, oh my god. I guess opt in response. Well, yeah, we'll do it at EOT. Damn. Okay. What does Crash Through do? Does it's it a, trample it's a cantrip. No, no, just trample. It's a cantrip. Okay. Eventually, we will see a Joel Rail. Look at that, three shot of the skies. In their first 19 cards, wow, they did well. That's worth it. You yeah. can play it and crash through. Yeah, we're not going to send that pack in. There we go, baby. All right, so... Doesn't matter what order these go in. Okay. And we got All right, enough. shatter of the sky, show it to us. Yeah, no, show me your four shatter. Let's party. I mean, they probably are running four shatters, right? Yeah, I would imagine. But statistically, if they have the next one, then that's just absolutely stupid. Shenanigans. Uh, but, but really nice resurgence after four shatter of the sky for yeah, this deck to just. I, I pop am back shocked. Up. Right. Yeah, I'm with you. I'm shocked how much resiliency this deck has. It's got a lot of card draw, is what it is. Uh, mouse over your deck really quick. How long did it take us to see that second? Oh, my God. 29 Half cards. Half of the deck. Yeah. And there are eight cards behind us. Okay, so they got their card draw one instead of their damage one, but their card draw one could draw them into their damage one, and it could go get their, you know, uh, definite clarion, which I know this deck has to be run. Oh, this is Ali Eldrazi. Are you kidding me? Nice. Nice. <laughs> Four shatters. <laughs> Okay, he said thanks. 
Oh my goodness. Ali Eldrazi, if you're not aware, is a he's a pro. He is a very good deck builder. Gotcha. All right. Uh, that sucks. All right, so he's ending my turn. <laughs> that is brutal. What was your word earlier when we were just getting slammed? Six mana, instant, instant speed, end the turn. That is brutal. What card does that? Discontinuity. Yeah, this is over. It was a good game, though. You can't count on... I mean, you're just playing around... I'm not going to play around Foreshadow this, guys. I don't think that there's anything else we can do here. Because now they're set up with their sanctums. That was a GG. Will you give him a GG on his channel if you're watching it? Yep. That was brutal. That was nice, though. Took us down. Took us down. May you draw mana in the appropriate ratio. I, I didn't see Filia de Luna kick off. If you're still around, catch you later. Oh yeah, everyone said thanks. Everyone said GG. A lot of his followers are saying GG. Yeah. It was a good game. Yeah. I mean, we were right there. If I, I just feel like if if he had had one fewer than four shatters, <laughs> we yeah. rebuilt after every single one with plenty of cards in our hand. He just wore us down. It was a really good game. Our arena client crashed at the right time. Um, just so you know, I'm going to have to walk the dog here in just a little bit. I'm going to take a, take a break, get outside, and then we can start back up. Have you got the client installed on your machine? Um, yeah, I think so. Nice. Hmm. <clears throat> Trying to get back into the game right now. Having a little problem with the cliento. Oh yeah, he's super safe. Where's a mask?
Oh man. Okay, we've got a client issue here. We're gonna force quit it. We're gonna smother it with a pillow and see if we can get it back going. And it. Uh, Nice. Okay, I think that's better. Let's try and restart it. Hope everybody's having a wonderful night. We appreciate you hanging out. If you're not already, please consider subscribing. We would really appreciate that. Oh man, maybe the client will let us in now. We are getting into the evening now, which is when a lot more people are going to be streaming this set um, through this early access. So we may hit a little clunkiness, but we're just going to push through. All right, let's try and run it back with the teamer deck. Okay, I think the client let us in. Oh my goodness, everybody. It's Hamhawks 42. I do like having the backup Joel Rail. Whoops, I'm on the wrong thing. There we go. That whole time you were gone, the client kicked me out and I was trying to get back in. You're literally seeing my first plays of the first match since you walked away. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, you know how it goes. Beautimus. After this match, um, let's go on mute. We can discuss what the evening looks like for us. Sure. Well, we could just discuss it. I'm just going to go walk the dog and uh, 